Hi my love, so I hope you're doing well. Today we're going to be doing a reading on Nicki Minaj. So a whole bunch of you guys asked me down below and the last video that I have done which was on Jenny Mai and Jeezy and if you haven't checked that out, the link would be in the description box. Um, but a whole bunch of you guys were telling me to do Nicki Minaj and the question that you guys were asking was just basically like a general reading on what's going on with Nicki Minaj and is she actually going to retire so i will be glad to do this reading on her so we're just going to get started so i'm going to be using Doreen virtues crystal deck okay and i'm going to be using two different decks as well including the amira salon deck if you're not subscribed to this channel what are you doing sis subscribe subscribe to this channel if you're not subscribed so you could be updated with all my latest video please click the thumbs up button if you like this video and if you like more celebrity readings and all my information in regards to my website and my social media is down in the description box so go check that out I did this makeup do you guys like it it's in homage of Nicki Minaj so I know you guys know that you know I, I like I like my uh, Cardi but in the beginning I did like my Nicki Minaj I'm not gonna lie about that you know I, I, I like her music um, I don't follow her though but I do like her music and I am a person that's very open-minded this is a judgment-free zone uh, I have no really bad opinions in regards to Nikki so we're going to connect with Nikki's guardian angel and we're going to call on the archangels and we're going to see what do they have to say in regards to just everything so what I'm going to ask her guardian angel is is she actually done with the music industry so let's see by the way guys if you want me to do this makeup look on my beauty channel my beauty channel is also in my description box here in this channel so if you're not subscribed to that channel as well please subscribe because i'm going to be uploading a lot of uh, makeup tutorials um and what do you call this eye look <laughs> isn't this eye look kind of cool okay so uh one card popped up Ridges. Okay, so they're telling me to stop. So the card that popped up is Amethyst. Okay, and it says over here, revealing your true self as you allow others to know the real you. You you feel loved for who you truly are. And let's see, let's pull out two more cards. It says over here, prosperity. There is a prosperity shift in your flow of divine support. Uh, so Nicki Minaj is not going to fully retire uh, she is just taking a break at the moment uh, the prosperity is also means abundance it doesn't always have to be finances so um, they are you know her and her husband because I'm um, being shown that she is married um, her and her husband is currently trying to conceive a child and I will let uh, well I'll let you guys know and Nicki Minaj she wants to know the time frame of when she's going to conceive okay um, but she's not going to fully stop uh, she's going to take a break for a little bit I don't see that she's going to be recording um, any new music for a while I'm, I won't say it's going to be like years uh, it's just going to be like a couple of months of being told it's going to be around four to five months uh, before she gives birth I do see that she's going to have a spark of interest in regards to recording music but she's gonna have different um different opportunities that's going to come her way and i'm being shown that the main opportunity that she's going that's going to come her way is more of movie roles i'm being told um because she's really passionate about that um i'm being told that she has a history in regards to acting um and she likes that a lot so she's going to be diving into that um i'm also being shown that there's a lot of business deals that's behind the scenes that uh of course i can't really talk about because this is something that's like really big that she's she wants to surprise her fans so it's best that i don't tell you guys uh what she's going to do because i don't want to spoil that for her like that's kind of bad um but 
there's a lot of uh, business uh, deals that's behind the scene. Um, I do see that she's also going to be involved um, a little bit in the cosmetic industry. So that's just kind of like one hit I could kind of tell you guys. But it's more behind the scenes in the music industry. Uh, little by little, not going to be too much. Um, it's more acting. I'm being told that she's going to be traveling a lot during this time. She just needs to disconnect her guardian angels are saying let's see it says over here your unique qualities are an important part of your life purpose it's okay to feel and be different from others so because Nicki Minaj you know revealing her true self because now she has found someone that she feels as though that she is able to be her true self uh, she feels as though that people are judging her too much to the point that she just wants to disconnect from the internet and just from social media in general um, and I always say too much social media is not healthy at all a lot of you guys always ask me and certain things like have you seen this have you seen that have you heard this I'm like no because I don't live on social media you know so sometimes it's okay for you to put your phone down you know what I mean so this is something that the angels really want her to do they just want her to disconnect from everything and she would do just that and you know it hurts her the fact that she can't fully be herself because every movement that she does everything that she does everything that everything that she says is always criticized and is always judged and um i'm being told that she comes across too mean but you know everybody has the right to you know, say how they feel and everybody has the right to defend themselves um, and she just feels as though she's always getting beat up uh, mentally so this is why she just wants to kind of get away let's pull out two more cards let me know if you like this deck I got this deck from my Amazon wish list so whoever sent me this deck thank you so much because it's a beautiful deck uh, and if you just want to check out my Amazon wish list it's in the description box and just thank you for you know just your gener generosity if you do decide to send me something from there uh, opal okay so it says over here let yourself sparkle and shine you are guided to be bold and show your bigger than life side to the world so just like what they said movie roles so that's one thing that's going to be the highlight of her break she's going to have many opportunities in regards so that's that's great nikki because what they're saying is that you are passionate about that so we're going to dive into the pregnancy right so we're going to see this is the deck that i'm looking for so we're going to see when is she going to conceive and whatever messages the angels have to say in regards to Nikki Minaj. Nikki. Nikki. Archangel Gabriel, thank you for coming through. Archangel Gabriel, he is the angel of fertility. He is the angel of new beginnings and um, creativity. Thank you for coming through these three cards want to come down so archangel gabriel says he says okay express love through gifts okay so this is the number 19 this is the numbers this is the number 16 so within 16 to 19 weeks she is going to be pregnant and over here there are birds and there's fishes see if you guys don't know fishes they also represent fertility um the sea also represents motherhood and fertility pregnancy so and, and if you guys don't know this looks like yamaya um the mother of the ocean she is an african deity yamaya is around her a lot so yamaya is coming through and she's saying that she's going to conceive within 16 to 19 weeks um, so that's amazing so congratulations Nikki the energy of the baby is a boy energy okay but you are gonna have two kids um, but the boy wants to come through it's a boy energy so they're not sure you know when it comes to um, babies they're not showing me the sex of the child they show me energy of the child so the baby could have boy energy but could be a female okay but they're just saying that the energy of the baby it's a boy and if you see what the boy is holding the boy is holding an egg okay which represents her ovaries represents her egg so the, her son is saying mom uh, i'm coming down soon <laughs> 
and she's going to be such an amazing mom and um she has dreamed for this for a very long time but she just felt as though it was just never the right time to have a kid because her career meant everything to her but she's going to be very compassionate very playful i do see that she's going to be laughing a lot she's just going to find everything in regards to her babies especially her son just adorable um and she's going to have a real deep connection with her child because there's going to be moments nikki uh if you're watching this or anybody in her camp that's related to her uh that's watching this uh well mean nikki you feel alone the majority of the time you talk a lot to yourself and it's okay everybody does this but you just i won't say that you do this every single day but you you do a lot of self-reflection and sometimes when you do a lot of self-reflection in the past it kind of like it, it brings you down a little bit um and sometimes you feel as though you have good people around you and there's some bad you know bad people around you some people that just want to you know say like yes to you all the time um and kind of like laughing all your jokes and stuff like that so you got to be careful because not all not all smiles can be trusted okay but you know okay they kind of go in left field i gotta continue they go in left field. They go in left field. Okay, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Be authentic. Okay, so this is for um, the father of her child. The father of her child uh, does care for her, um, but there is an energy around him. It's a dark energy around him that she has to be careful um, because he does care for her. He, you know, is falling in love with her. Okay, but he has had an agenda um and if you guys see this 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 card kind of represents kind of like daydreaming and stuff like that so he has had an, uh, an agenda he has had a plan to be with her for a while but it was not always good intentions um because of what i'm being told is that he talks to other people on the side um because if you see there is a guy that has the flute that represents a guy in the music industry meaning he is in the music industry but he's not singing you know what i mean but there is a woman there is a woman that there's communication you see the the cloud of the woman kind of like in days this woman's in days kind of like oh my god so uh nick you gotta be really careful he's not going to do it in front of your face he's going to do it behind your back so you have to be really careful okay because um what i'm being shown is infidelity but this is via text message um and it's not like he's going to sleep with people because he doesn't even have the opportunity to go sleep with people because he's always with you um but there is emotional treating that happens to a lot of people that at times he does this um because this is just something that he's just used to and that he has to break but it's not like he does it every single day it looks like every other day um but when the baby is born this is going to be frequent that he's going to do this so this is just an alert to let you know that um, his intentions with you see appreciate appreciate this moment so uh, this is what the angels are saying to uh to mr petty i could kind of say i don't know his name first name sorry um to appreciate everything that 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 that, that nikki is doing for you right now because if it wasn't for this girl you wouldn't be where you're at even though you 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 hustled your way and you sacrificed and you done a whole bunch of shit not good things the angels are saying okay not good things but people are able to change but they see certain things that they're not liking okay and they say appreciate this moment because if you fuck up it's not going to last okay and in the beginning nikki you're going to be blindsided okay so you're not going to see you're going to feel as though he's not doing anything you're not going to believe with anything what people are saying people's going to tell you certain things and people's going to tell you certain things via what they see from the corner of their eyes and just the energy the vibration of him that they're going to say oh, okay like but something is really off you're going to disconnect from people and the more that you disconnect from these people it's going to be kind of like here it is you know it's like the angels are going to show you look at this okay so they're not gonna show you they're not telling you exactly what they're gonna do to you but they're gonna show you look this is what's going down and they're gonna feel really sad about it but you're not gonna you're not going to talk about it to anybody it is going to make national news um and you are going to defend your partner i'm being told but you're going to feel hurt because you're just going to try to do uh there's a feather you're just going to try to do uh okay this feather <laughs> you're just going to try to do damage control 
I'm being told. Okay, so let's put out one more card. This card wants to come out. It says over here, get to know each other. So uh, what your angel is saying, Nikki, is that you, you don't know him truly. So you know him due to many years of where he's from and you know x y and z right you, you know him but what the angels are saying is that you don't know him like that so just be careful it's just a warning okay um so yeah let's throw the, the mirror salon deck nikki's a good person guys this is what the angel's saying she's a good person give her a break a little bit um, also be shown that you are going to get property um, and with high security because you're going to be really anxious because you're not going to really trust anybody in regards to the baby let me pick this up <clears throat> mature man there is a mature man that is around you this is an ancestor that he's watching over you this is from mommy's side okay he's saying that he's very proud of you wallflower so this is a wallflower card this represents now the present and the future so what they're saying is that you're just kind of bored at the moment you know there's nothing that's really interesting in you right now that's a lot of competition and uh, what i mean so you do feel a little bit you know i won't say it's scared but you do feel like ugh. you know like because i'm seeing like i like ugh. You know, um, because they, you do a lot of kitchen table talk and you have to be very careful who you talk to. Okay. Um, so it's kind of like, ugh, like all these performances and you just kind of like looking at them like with disgust or kind of like, ugh, like, all right, whatever. You know, um, also this card in the back, this represents infidelity. So this is just what the angels just mentioned to you that, you know, um, your husband is going to cheat on you in the future okay and this is going to be on social media it's going to be a national news it's going to be all over but this is after the baby is born because what i'm being sure this is a point in time that you're going to feel a little bit more insecure about yourself and you're going to be kind of like when you feel insecure you tend to question a lot of things um it says over here spiritual growth um, so during this break you are going to be connected a little bit more with your third eye so just always ask your angels to make sure that they show you the truth when it comes to anything not just only in regards to love when it comes to family when it comes to friends when it just comes to co-workers you know the entertainment world and just everything in general uh, what i'm being told is that you're going to be a little bit more closer to your mom during that time um so that's great this card over here, so that's a spiritual growth. This card over here, it says over here, destiny. So your your destiny, your destiny, your career path is going to change a little bit. And, you know, it, it is time for a change because, you know, you're trying to see open relationship. Jesus Christ. Look, look how I'm holding the cards, right? Open relationship communication. So this is Kevin. This is a warning sign. This is a warning sign okay that he's going to open relationship that he's going to cheat on you okay um that he, he's already flirting now but like actually like stepping out and cheat on you is gonna happen in the near future communication you know this is a good time for you to just not even like look through your phone and if you're gonna look through your phone watch youtube videos laugh you know just chill out um but don't use social media for a while but they're saying that you're not gonna last for a long time of social media so just just try to disconnect okay passion um this is also in regards to uh the infidelity um so yeah it's, it's sad to see this okay it's, it's really sad to see this you know we don't want this for anybody you are going to have a style change okay which is great um i do see that you are going to fire um two people you're going to disconnect from two people that works with you um, but just be nice about it because what I'm being told is if you don't be nice that they're gonna talk about you You don't want that either. You know, you're just kind of tired of people talking about you like you're done. Okay It says over here courting man. So this is a person that is in your record label that is going to be Talking to you in regards to your career of like, okay, what what's next? Um, this could be a manager. This could be just someone in regards to music that's gonna be questioning you like what's next? Um, you answer that when the time comes okay and let's just throw that one more ice king ice king so um what the angels are saying is that 
you know Kevin is you're portraying Kevin in a way you want Kevin to be really likable but uh, everybody knows whoever watching my videos knows what this car means uh, he has a dark side to him okay um, so there's moments like they say you do feel alone so there's moments that he's cold to you okay uh, sometimes he does feel as though you could be overbearing he could disconnect for a little bit but you of course you're not going to talk about this all right um so they just let you know the, that thing needs to be fixed um the stubbornness needs to be fixed in the relationship communication is good but the stubbornness needs to be worked on okay let's just throw down one more card uh what deck we're going to use we're going to be using a mixture of i forget what this deck is called but i got this from amazon wish this as well so thank you so much guys it means a lot <sighs> these two cards the truth see the truth the pleasure card so this is also infidelity so this is a big warning side guys um so yeah i'm gonna end this let me just pull out one more card from this deck and then we're gonna go to the uh, compromise okay so she, you're gonna talk to you're gonna talk to someone in regards to your career um in regards to this big business deal that's gonna happen okay and god is approving of this and god is saying go ahead go ahead it's going to go well um and you your supporters are going to whew, they're going to like really like buy this thing out like in seconds which is awesome it's awesome let's see let's bring out one card from the archangels right <sighs> which archangel is going to be around you nikki during this time okay and when i'm being told that nikki is like really funny um i don't watch nothing like you guys know that um but when i'm being told that she's really funny but sometimes people could take her humor in a really bad light okay Archangel Gabriel. I had a feeling that Archangel Gabriel is going to be her, be around her because Archangel Gabriel, like I said, he just spoke to her a few seconds ago, right? Um, but Archangel Gabriel, like I mentioned, he's the angel of creativity and she, you know, she is very creative. You know, she's very smart. She has written a lot of music. She has written uh, uh, not only for herself but for other people. Um, she has a lot of creative control in regards to her career. Um, so as a leadership role, it's time for you to assume your leadership power and position and lovingly guide others. So you're going to be um, kind of like a like an influencer, like kind of like when someone comes out in the music industry, you're going to kind of like support them. You're going to be like, okay, like cheering them on, giving them praise, uh, supporting them, jumping on their music right away. Um, what I'm being told is... Um, after you give birth that's going to be your biggest year like your biggest year your biggest comeback um you gotta come back before you give birth i'm being told but it's a big song that's going to come out it's huge just another song that's coming out soon i'm being told um but it's with somebody else so it doesn't look like it's your song um but when you're pregnant you're going to be working on a huge project in regards to music and your friends are going to bug out of happiness which is cool um so yeah and i do cc the music instruments here so they're just basically talking about your career archangel gabriel um so yeah archangel gabriel um he wants to let you know that you are loved you are special you are precious okay you deserve everything in the world you just have to be more in tune with your intuition okay and don't trust everybody that is around you uh, because not everybody has good intentions including your partner at times okay he's a little bit like a f you remember uh, from dora the explorer swiper no swiping it's like swiper so you gotta be careful okay um so yeah guys thank you so much for watching um if you like this video please let me know please let me know what celebrity you want me to do next and i will speak to you later Mucho besos.